Traveling to Mars number 10. This is one of my favorite series coming out right now. It's by Ablaze Comics, written by Mark, Mark Russell, who's uh, writing a few books that I'm reading right now. The premise of this is kind of a spoiler, so be forewarned. There's a man from Alabama who's been sent to Mars uh, because he has terminal cancer. And if they don't have to worry about a return mission, then this corporation that's sending him there can secure the mineral rights and become insanely wealthy. So they're going to give his folks some stuff. And he just has a lot of time to ride on this rocket and uh, get to Mars. By this point, he's at Mars. Uh, he's, you know, he's befriended his uh, android partners here, these rovers down on the planet and stuff. Well, these guys came with him on the, these are like helper robots. They came with him on the trip. But now he's got uh, other robots that are on the planet coming to him. And he's literally a day away from death at this point. So he's sort of ruminating on his life. This whole series is a lot of, uh, sort of this guy's philosophy on his life and his struggles and his relationships. And it's really beautifully written. It's, uh, it's, there's a couple of these issues that really stick out to me, um, and are pretty powerful, just sort of, uh, describing the human condition in a way that I haven't heard described before. And some really beautiful sort of thoughts about this life, you know, and death and her mortality, and what it all means. So for kind of a, you know, sci-fi premise, and there's some action and stuff, uh, it's a really sort of heartfelt story that I think a lot of people are appreciating. There's, uh, it's got some Eisner nominations and stuff, and I'm, if if you have a chance to check it out, I'm sure it'll be out in some trades. Uh, highly recommended, Traveling to Mars.